Hey guys, Fiber Prone 2 as Dorumon. And I am back with part two of Let's Play Digimon World 4. Now in last vid in the last video, um we went over the basic beginning stuff. Um, did some training to figure out how to play and have been while well, we have been told what we're supposed to go through to Death Mountain. So without further ado, let's begin. Death Mountain, you're pretty it's pretty standard. It's a good place to do your level one stuff. So occasionally when you get into uh a new place, uh, aka right now it's Death Mountain. You get to see a few extra things. You get to see like um, one kind of Digimon that's in there, like in this case it's Algoborimon, and um, like what kind of Digimon they are, stuff like that, like what their special moves are, all the good stuff. Okay, only 300, but I, I only gotta kill like, what, 30 of these to get a new level up? Okay. Ugh, why can't these guys die any faster? So yeah, your basic weapon, like your bash katana, which is what I have your shot pistol and your crush arm your basic stuff it's gonna take a while for if you use those it's gonna take a while to beat these guys but don't worry I guess you know what they say slow and steady wins the race right Oy, I'm trying to stay positive in this whole thing there's not much to talk about right now oh I got some bits that'll be useful later now I drop nothing cheap. Gate discs. So, what I just picked up- oh, I might need that. What I just picked up here, and I have picked up one earlier, is a gate disc. Gate discs immediately let you transport back to your base. And... Many traps are hidden in this world to keep you from accomplishing your mission. All of them are smartly contri contrived, contrived, I have no idea how to pronounce that, so be careful as you go on. So yeah, there'll be many kinds of traps, and so on and so forth. So in every area, you'll come across areas where doors are locked and you can't go any further. Open these doors, you usually need two or more specific ID passes. ID passes are kept in the dungeons and bosses behind the bosses in dungeons. Use them to obtain the necessary ID passes. When you have obtained all ID passes needed to open a door, several switches in the front door will activate. So every time you get all the keys required, this will light up and go to whatever inactive switches, depending on how many characters are, there are, each character, like 1, 2, 3, or 4, will have to go on a switch depending on how many is playing. And since it's only me, I only have to press this one and activate it, it opens and lets you move on to the final area. So yeah. That's pretty much basic stuff. And the amount of inactive one um, switches will increase depending on how many characters are playing. I hate this controller sometimes. But I don't know where to find a new a new controller. Although I'd love to know. Alright, so we got to get rid of these Numamon flinging catapults. Oh. Oh god. That was horrible. That was beyond horrible. Oh, I'm almost dead. I'm almost dead. I'm almost dead. I'm almost dead. I'm almost, almost dead. Okay, guys. You might just see my first fail. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Um. Let me just use my shot pistol for now and back up and get these guys from a range. 
Oh god. Because I'm out of MP as well, and I should have stock up on some discs or something. Oh! As you just saw, that little tick and the little arrow pointing is a tech up. Well, that's what happens when you die. It's a tech up. And depending on what you use. Hold on. Yeah. Never mind then. And depending on what you use, like in this case I used the shot pistol, so my shot ability went up a little bit. Which was pretty good in a sense, I guess. But since I'm not really using a shot, not too important. I can't believe I've already died on the second video. My god. Ugh. Okay, so you see those little crystals that I sadly seem to have dropped. And every time you get one of those crystals, uh, all one of those crystals are on the ground. You have it. You can use your um, raise disc, which is another disc, to pick it up and get what you dropped from your death back. But since I don't seem to have any raise discs, that's gonna be a bit of a problem. If I didn't get trapped by that freaking Numamon, uh, I just hate it. God. Dang! <sighs> I'm so mad right now! Oh my freaking god! Oh, oh, never mind. Okay, I thought you lost some experience that you gained while doing it too. You might have, I just probably didn't notice it enough. Oh, my game's screwing up on me. You can tell by the music, holding that one long note. See? And you just use a raise disc and bada bing bada boom. But I don't have a raise disc and I hope one of these freaking enemies I can get one if they stop blocking me. I am not happy right now. I am not happy. I'm not even going that way anymore. Screw you, Numeron, and your Numeron cannons. I think I found a new hatred of a certain Digimon. I curse, I curse that Numamon and all who inhabit, uh, and all who are friends with it. I hope you die. Wait, no, it was a Gaborimon that killed me. Oh, and there's plenty of Gaborimon to take out my anger on. I need a raise this. Oh god, I'm dying already. Game better fit. Oh my god. You could not be serious. I am not dying twice in this one video. Oh my freaking. Oh my god. This, this is just horrible. in one video. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, 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 oh my gosh. I hate this so much. Alright, let's see what I can do. Okay. I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go in there one more time. No, I'm not. Maybe next video, and if my game would freaking make sense now and stop repeating the same beat over and over again. Thank you. My god, this is not a good day for me.
This might be a short video, but I really don't care right now. Let's take a little tour. The save keeper, pretty straightforward. You can save your game here. There's an Agumon. Booster, there's a card keeper. When you um, Throughout the game, you'll collect booster packs. Um, as seen here, the B pack one. You know, the one that's like right there. So, when you collect booster packs, you can't open them yourself, so you have to come to this Digi-Elf, digi and she'll open it for you. Nothing here, nothing here, another- hey, it's another me! The more you use your skill tech- oh yeah, I already explained that. Ghoulmon. Nothing here, nothing here. A Vmon. Some Digi-Elves. Ah. Digi-Elves. Sheesh. Alright, you know what? I really... I'm just... Yeah, okay. That's... That'll be shown later on. Boy. Not my happy video. You know what? I'm just gonna... I'm gonna stand here. Alright. With my other failures, I'm just gonna stop the video here, and maybe do the other parts. I get other part, like on the same day, but I might post it different days. Alright, so this is Fiverr Pwn 2 signing out with part 2 of Digimon. Later guys.